Hello guys, how you doing? So, I'm going to watch episode 11 of March Comes In Like a Lion today. And it was quite painful to watch uh, that moment uh, uh, with Ray just uh, letting it out. And uh, I mean, it was just, it's like he was filling up with all of these emotions. And at this point, um, he just bursted and started like shouting everything uh, he, he was feeling. Um, and he was uh, also not wrong about what he was saying. I mean, this is uh, like too real, like sometimes feeling like uh, you are the reason uh, everything is um, like uh, happening or like that it's your fault that um, like a lot of uh, people's lives are being uh, ruined when it's not uh, uh, actually like that. Is Again, it's, it, it's really hard to explain, but it's pretty much um, what he was saying, like... It's not actually his fault that um, these things uh, keep happening. It's just uh, unfortunate that he keeps uh, getting uh, uh, into these uh, types of situations. And again, it's uh, it's really hard to um, like to explain these uh, these things. But it's something that uh, that really eats me. And uh, like again, it's uh, too real. It's, it, like it's something I can relate to um, quite a bit. But yeah, either way, I want to see what he's going to do from now on. I mean, it's just uh, at this moment and uh, I don't know um, if uh, he's going to like change to some extent or if he's going to uh, do something that uh, I am not uh, expecting. But yeah, just really can't wait to find out um, about it. So, hope you guys are ready and let's start this episode. I'm also worried about the guy he was playing with. It's like he was losing everything. Like, losing everything he loved. Like, he was about to get divorced and... He also lost this match right before Christmas, so... Of course his mood was going to... He like really bad. He didn't even care about the the Christmas gifts. He was he balked before. It was a really sad situation. Sometimes I don't even know like what to say. It's it's really complicated in the end. Like Ray, of course, not wanting to lose the match, but knowing that if he wins, he's going to ruin someone's life again, even if he's. He doesn't want that, but he doesn't like want to lose. Obviously, it's again really complicated. It's not his fault. Oh. Became sick. It's not good. He's all by himself. I wonder if Nikaido is checking on him. I would expect that to be the case. Damn. I guess he's been alone for a while now. Yeah, I guess it's like Christmas time and New Year, so people are with their families. 
They probably don't know that he's going through this right now. Hmm, a dead end. And I don't know, they didn't sp he didn't spend like Christmas with Akari and like the sisters. Like, someone is there. Is it Nikaito? Wait, is that Momo? It's Momo! <laughs> For a moment I thought it was Nikaido doing, doing some funny voices. <laughs> Sometimes he has those moments. Oh, it's all three of them! They're bringing him back to their place so they can take care of him and spend New Year's with him. Oh, they're going... Okay, that makes more sense. So it's only a cold. That's nice. Can be treated there. Man, this is so nice. They are always so kind to him. It's really heartwarming to watch this. Like heartwarming? I'm sure about the actual way to say it. Oh. She wants to call his father. We probably has a lot of Nikaido's calls maybe. No, it's his father calling him. Was worried. Yeah, I mean, he's not alone.
<laughs> That's so adorable. Everyone just really warm. Hmm. Good point. Oh. It's like mom like doctor. Oh. Ooh. Hmm. Yeah, I can understand that. Oh, damn. Yeah, he felt that. It's like his presence makes her not think about the sad things. And that was quite the moment. I mean, she's mother and sister. She wants cuddles. Is he better? Hmm. <laughs> oh my god. That's an interesting toy. It's a lot of them.
Hmm. Maybe you would be surprised. Oh my god. I hope he has some. Oh. Oh, he has two. It's Nikai though. I mean, not a surprise. The other one though. Maybe his father? Oh. Okay then. <laughs> That's a surprise. Aunt Misaki? Ooh. Wait, don't tell me she she has one for Ray as well? Oh damn <laughs> kidnapped you. <laughs> That's a way to put it. Okay then. It's like he helped the business. I don't know if this was mentioned before that she's the one working uh, or like she owns the business Akari's owned. I have a feeling they they mentioned it. Hmm. Oh, damn. She's on a mission. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Man, she's really fun, though. Soccer game. Hey, that looks really nice. And now I'm hungry. Man, that just looks so good. Ooh. 
and burger turtles. That's a first. Hey, they put a lot of work into this. Gum. I definitely wouldn't mind getting one of those now. And the cat is just drooling <laughs> all over the place. It's really nice to see them spending this time together. Ooh, something new? Ooh. Wait! They're going to... Oh my god. <laughs> that explains. They don't want him to see too much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was something. But it's nice that they can do that there. It's even if the owls is not that big, it's like a cozy place. They have a bit of everything. I mean... Reminds him of how it was before. Hmm. I mean, it, they all make him feel at home here. That's really nice. When it's over. And I really love these moments. I mean, it's always sad to see him by himself. It's like he's little by little realizing his mistakes and like how he's a bit too selfish sometimes about like how he is only thinking about his own feelings and not like thinking about how other people feel as well like more specifically the situation with um, Akari and how even though she's like really sweet and really kind and like uh, all cheerful during these moments 
like deep inside she's still suffering because of what she lost right her mother and grandmother and it was it was a really like important moment with her saying that like how it was actually Ray saving her because if he wasn't there she wouldn't have been um, as happy it's like I don't know how to put it but it's like when you don't have uh, someone to distract you and to make you think about um, other things you might just end up going back to like thinking about um, the the sad moments in your life so it's like uh, with uh, Ray being there she could be distracted enough to not think about uh, the ones um, she lost so that way she could have um, like a happy time uh, uh, here so that was definitely that was really like a um, a really wholesome moment between all of them. I really enjoyed uh, um, this episode and how it was more uh, on the um, like cheerful side. So seeing uh, them having uh, a good time um, uh, together, uh, and then uh, Ray having um, like this uh, moment as well. So actually, it's like he feels at home here. Like they make him feel uh, at home uh, at this place. So. Again, they are helping him a lot, and again, it's it's like Akari said, it's not just uh, them helping Ray, like, he, he's helping them uh, as well, just by being here, so, it's like a, a mutual, um, uh, like, help, or so to say, I don't know how exactly to put this, but I really like it, and um, I really hope that, um, at some point, uh, they can have, um, like, I don't know how to put it, but... A happier life of course they are all happy together but it's not like uh, uh, they have um, achieved what uh, uh, like I don't know how to say it but like achieve uh, true happiness so like to achieve their goals and stuff and to actually do uh, something that uh, they really want um, while they are um, uh, alive of course but yeah I don't know what that's going to be I mean uh, Akari's aunt wants her to to be like to follow her dreams and to to like end up being with someone and to not be stuck here just doing um, like housekeeping uh, stuff like she wants her to find uh, someone um, uh, to love and to have uh, um, a happier life uh, uh, like once again like i said but yeah i don't know if um, if akari actually wants to um, like, I don't know, like, to work at that bar, like, of course her aunt is only trying to help, but I don't know if that's uh, uh, what she wants. It's really hard to know at this point. It's something that I will have to uh, to see um, later on, like, to see this uh, development. But yeah, I'm really enjoying uh, all of these, and I wonder um, what exactly is um, going to happen next, now that this... Uh, a uh, new year um, uh, is starting. I mean, hopefully it will be um, a better one uh, than the previous one. But yeah, just uh, really can't wait to see um, what will happen. So, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this episode. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.